Bob, I set you up just before we went into the break about some of the imagery now that we're seeing from the space station. And I think you've sort of said, Earth is on fire. You can see a lot of bright lights that in previous times would not have been able to be seen from space, but Earth looks different now. And that should be an alarm bell for all of us. Absolutely. And there are even pictures that NASA puts out that you can scroll back and forth that show before and after, not only showing the effects of forest fire, drought, drying up lakes, but also how big our cities have grown. Our population has grown. We're, we're way beyond 7 billion now. And they're, uh, it's showing our, our footprint. We're visible from space. Our fires are visible from space. You've probably seen those beautiful nighttime shots from the space station where cities are glowing, you know, and it's, it's very beautiful to see. But to me, that's a metaphor for how much energy we're burning down here. We're just burning away. And all that light that goes up into space, we don't use. We put lights on the ceiling so they can shine down on the floor and so we can see where we're going, where we walk. That's useful light. Light that shines up is light we're throwing away. So all that light from space is energy we're not using. And we also throw away heat, we throw away food, we throw away water, we're, we, we throw away, in some cases, more than we use. And this is part of what we have to start looking at as we face climate change, which I think is the issue of the 21st century. 